My name is Matthias. I'm running the Analec business in Germany for the Omnicom Media Group. I'm part of the group since two and a half years. One of my key focuses is leading the whole network. These are the three agencies like OMD, PhD and Hearts and Science into a privacy first world. Augury and Analec are partners over the course of a couple of years already. We found that for challenging the status quo, Augury is a super agile partner, specifically in defining precise audiences and targeting them at scale. Last year, we started a cooperation based on the Augury approach, leveraging second party data as well as panel based data to define precise audiences. And we thought of, is it possible to integrate those target audiences with our planning approach? So planning in Omnico Media Group means we use research data and panel data to define channel budgets and then derive from those audiences also digital targetings. The overall goal of our cooperation is uh, to include Augury's audiences and connect them in our workflow and then make them available to every trader. <laughs> Advertisers still need digital reach and precision. So there are two types of alternatives. The first is leveraging IDs such as first party data. Those might underlie as well some privacy regulations from browsers, but also from other players in the market. The other solution is leveraging non-ID based targetings deriving the audience through the context, deriving the audience through research. Learning these new abilities, leveraging these capabilities is a big challenge. First is what is the right solution? What are the vendors providing this? What are the solutions giving me the scale? But on the other side, it's the cost of adoption. Being capable across a network of hundreds of traders is really challenging us as an agency and therefore every advertiser. So we need to find the right recipe of new addressability. So we as a media agency, we plan audiences across channels. So we rely on deep research insights, which can be category, brand specific, even product specific. Translating this into digital requires a link. And this is where the system often breaks. So we as a media agency are really, really good in defining the right budget level across channels for non-addressable media. But for addressable media, the market is very, very fragmented and complex. So we need to define the linkage between research and the offering and digital. And this complexity can be seen by only looking at the open market targeting and the platforms. They all use their different languages. They describe someone who's interested in e-mobility, for instance, in different words and different aggregations and different precisions. What we are building on is specifically the capability in linking research and digital addressability. And here we leverage AI using semantic algorithms to connect the actual audience with the digital viable personas and digital targetings. Traders select the digital targetings being available in the market using different languages, while the actual definition of the audience is lacking. So what we need is we need to combine the audience insights with the available targetings on the inventory we use in order to activate programmatic campaigns. And this is what we see what Augury, for instance, is doing, like combining zero-party data and contextual data with research and inventory in order to target against. But we as an agency, we need to orchestrate the full picture. So therefore, we invest also in capabilities in order to connect those research insights with the market offerings, digital targeting and inventory in order to scale for the given brand, for the defined audience and the focused campaign targets. Starting again from the promise from Augury that they use research and panel data and combine this with zero party data and contextual targeting applied to relevant inventory. Dacia, for instance, has really well-defined audiences using a different audience panel. So the case was to combine our audience planning tools with the one from Augury. So we used a technology which we call the audience machine and mapping the audience and the given taxonomies from Augury using relevant automotive segments, but also complementary ones, defining um, interests and demographics, for instance, and some affinities with the planning audience from Dacia. We came up with an innovative solution 
and prioritizing the right audience set and testing this against the usually used targeting inventory and platforms. So what we did is we ran a test using this approach and we found that we have a six times higher audience precision definition using the signals and the audience targetings from Augury mapped to our planning tools in order then to address the right audience for the given Dutch campaign. What we also found some significant results was like more than 20 times higher reaction rates to the ad itself, like increasing the click-through rate. What this means is that the response from the audiences being addressed with a message in the right context with the right time is much, much more driven from the definition we choose using Augury and the mapping to our planning tools. And this is a great success. What we also see with Dacia um, being um, happy about the result and confirms our strategy, how we extend cooperation with Augury to extend the audience taxonomy and bring this into our Omnicom Media Group audience planning and activation approach in order to provide this approach to every trader in the group. If there's one trend, it's the constant change. We're living in times where we have multiple forces influencing digital media and addressable addressability. So the first um, trend we see is next to this constant evolution, this morphing status quo, the agency is to find the ability and define the ability to gain new capability. So that means identifying which solution is the one which is the right for our advertisers at that stage for this audience. And this is something where we clearly see the greatest potential. It's audience-centered planning and activation. Understanding the audience, their key beliefs, their need states, relying on research and connecting this with inventory, which we can target across publishers in country and maybe even build capabilities internationally, is definitely something where we as Omnicom Media Group heavily invest into.